Once upon a time, far, far away, there lived a king who had a beautiful daughter who was a princess. They lived in a castle surrounded by a large forest. For her birthday one year, the king gave her a golden ball as a present. In the middle of the forest there was a very big pond. When the princess was bored, she would sit by the pond and play with her golden ball. It was her favorite toy. One day, she dropped the ball into the water. The pond was so deep that she could not see the bottom. The poor princess was so upset that she began to cry. As she cried, a voice called out, Why are you crying, princess? When she looked around, she saw a big ugly frog in the water. I have lost my golden ball. The princess sobbed. Don't cry, said the frog. If you promise to be my friend, let me eat from your plate and sleep in your bed, then I will fetch you your ball. Yes, I promise, the princess replied. Silly frog, she thought, he will never be able to leave the pond. The frog dived down and swam up with the ball in his mouth. The princess was so happy. She picked up the ball and ran away. Wait shouted the frog you can't leave without me but the princess didn't listen she didn't want to be friends with an ugly frog later that day when the princess had sat down to dinner she heard a knocking at the door open the door princess and let me in croaked a voice from behind the door the princess opened the door and saw to her horror the frog ah she shrieked is it a giant? asked the king. The princess explained about her promise. Well, said the king, what you have promised you must do. Go and let him in. The princess went to let in the frog and he hopped after her right up to the table and asked to eat off her plate. The princess didn't want to, but knew she had to keep her promise. The frog ate until he was full, but the princess could hardly eat at all. When the frog had finished his dinner, he wanted to sleep and asked the princess to take him to bed. The princess started to cry because she didn't want to sleep in the same bed as the slimy frog. But the king insisted that she took him. Now, said the frog, you must kiss me good night. Yuck, thought the princess. She didn't want to kiss the ugly frog, but she thought of her golden ball and remembered what she had promised, so she shut her eyes and kissed the frog. Suddenly, the frog had turned into a handsome prince. He told the princess that he had been changed by a wicked witch and that only she could set him free. Soon they became very good friends. They lived happily ever after. Morals, keep your promises. Please like and share it for and wide and subscribe the channel.